Equator Bottlers, we have developed an intense CSR policy, as we are conscious of the key role we play in the community where we operate. In fact, we always say that we are here not just to refresh our consumers, but to be an active agent in the community, especially with women and with youth. In this line, and besides being one of the most important employers in the region, we have done quite a lot of activities on the ground in terms of CSR, segmented in four main initiatives. Women empowerment, youth empowerment, community support, and environmental initiatives. Equator Bottlers has been involved in an ingenious project that is aimed at providing point of sale setup areas for local small scale entrepreneurs and 95% of these are women beneficiaries. Since this project began two years ago, we have managed to set up approximately 5,000 point of sale areas. This is in line with the Coca-Cola initiative, the 5x20 project, which is aimed at empowering 5 million women by 2020 across the globe. We have had Coca-Cola as one of our key partners. They have identified the need to empower women. We have seen our women move from uh, small businesses to the kiosks. To, to me, that's a, that's a big thing. Kabla nianze kuuza soda ya coke, nilikuwa na uza skuma, na nilikuwa na tandika chini. Kampuni ya coke venye likuja, nilikuja kanyeze share, kaniletea rack, nikawacha kuuza skuma chini, kaniletea ice box, na uza soda, na uza potatoes, na pika chips. Sana nimesema asante sana kwa watu wa coke. Kama hivi, mi nikona msia na hitu wa morena, Sikuwa na pesa ya kumpeleka shuleni, lakini saizi anaenda shuleni. Tena nimepeleka private school na nalipa na pesa ya kampuni ya kok. Junauza soda ya kok na nitapata pesa. Being an equal opportunity employer is an integral value for the company. When I joined 14 years ago, we were only six ladies employed by the company. But right now, we are around 200 ladies employed by this company in various fields, that is operation, sales in the field, the operating line, and uh, in the office. Women empowerment is important because in every society, women are the backbone. When you empower women, you are empowering the whole society. As a company, we look for ways to center some of our programs on youth empowerment. Equator Bottlers realizes that the future lies in the hands of the youth and it is important to support them. The Border Border Initiative is one of the projects we have focused on to empower youth. The Coca-Cola company partnered with us and uh, supported us with uh, some uh, products of theirs uh, in order for us uh, to generate income. We have seen a very big change amongst ourselves. The money that we generate from this business, it helps us to loan it to our members. Development support programs are some of the areas that we have looked at to tap into youth empowerment in institutions and so far we have managed to work with institutions such as Maseno University where we have gone into the schools and supported the schools with talent programs and we've also set up recreational facilities in the school where the students can go relax and also sip some refreshments. Coca-Cola is one of our partners when it comes to student activities. For example, we have uh, one big event per year called Mr. and Ms. Maseno, and Coca-Cola has partnered with us in terms of sponsorship, giving gifts and prizes for the models. So that has been ongoing. Coca-Cola has also provided us with some tents, chairs, tables where students can sit, and uh, some entertainment center where they can relax. So it has been a very uh, good and productive partnership. Water has become a limited natural resource in most parts of the world and its availability is a key challenge facing the community. The major challenge in schools have been the pit latrines. We are happy that as we are talking today, all 14 schools, both primary and secondary, have been able to get a donation as part of the social corporate responsibility. We used to have few latrines that were used by different classes. So we find that during break time we have a congestion of children running to line up before the few latrines that existed. But uh, right now the congestion has isn't because at least we have a latrine for each class and also each gender. 
the tank project which has been brought into the school has eased that congestion of children getting water from the taps that we have. Atukuwa na vio, hapa awali tulikuwa tunasumbukana, kuwa na vio kama tatu, lakini saizi, kwa uwezo yanyi tunasema kia santi. We provide free treated water for the Kogon community surrounding the plant and this can be accessed at any time in whatever quantity. We are firm believers in environmental conservation and we have engaged in different projects to implement this. At Equera Bottlers, we understand that environmental performance is critical to the success of our business. Our main responsibility is to ensure a healthy and sustainable environment at all levels of our operations. We've done this by transitioning from a fossil fuel boiler to a biofuel boiler, which has a lower carbon emission. One of the areas that we partner with Coca-Cola is taking care of our environment. We've been planting trees, we've been having a procession around the town to create awareness to the public on the importance of taking care of our environment. Coca-Cola has provided seedlings. Apart from that, they've participated in doing the actual planting. So it's a big way in giving to the whole community in Kenya. They've at least touched the hearts of all the students in this campus, and that means they've touched the hearts of Kenyans. This initiative was a brainchild of Equator Coca-Cola Bottlers, who have partnered with the Kisumu County government so as to help in a cleaning exercise at the bus park. People have stopped throwing garbage anywhere. There's that public sensitization. Equator Bottlers also realizes that it is very important to support local government and nurture the growth of other businesses. I am very happy with the partnership that we have formed with Equator Bottlers here in Kisumu. They have done a lot of things to Kisumu County through the CSR program. Generally speaking, I'm very, very happy that Equator Bottlers is working very, very closely with the Kisumu County. Nilikuwa nikifunga kazi mapema sana. Sa kumina mbili nilikuwa lazima ni jitayarishe ni funge, ni rudizango nyumbani. Lakini baada ya kuwekewa muangaza huu, e, ni nashukuru kwa sababu ni nafanya paka ata usiku, sa sita za usiku, sa ingine naenda paka asubui. In Equator, Youth and Women Empowerment form an integral part of our commercial strategy. We invest a lot in trolleys that we give to the youth to do vending of soda. In most cases, we even give seed capital to those who cannot start so that these youth have a, a way to earn a living and to get engaged. We have over 200 youth doing trolley vending and earning a living to feed their families. Youth empowerment is very, very important because it helps youth to be very busy. It helps youth to get, generate their daily income. This job has, has helped me so much. The money I'm getting, the, the income, the daily income I'm getting here right now, it has helped me even now to have my own, I have my own house. Most recently, we got into yet another partnership with the county government of Kisumu to build a children's park in the heart of Kisumu city. In terms of figures, we have uh, invested $1 million in the 5 per 2020 project, empowering 5,000 women by creating and supporting micro businesses managed by them. And we're investing an average of $500,000 per year in the other CSR projects, which is quite a remarkable quantity taking into account the size of the company and the size of the community where we operate. Corporate social responsibility is a key mandate in our business and we have managed to touch the lives of many and we are committed to changing the lives of many more.